Hello guys and wel welcome to uh, 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 welcome to uh, uh, Mar Mario Party One. Uh, we are going to we are, we are going to do some, we're, we're going to do some LMAO, also known as Let's Mess Around on. So and that is Mario Party Mario Party One because. Let's mess around on Mario Party. I've even seen a lot of people doing Let's Mess Around on Mario Party 1 even. So, I think I might as well even. What the hey? Just do it. And so, yes. We're gonna do this. So, obviously, we have Yoshi because he's so happy. Alright. Michaela. Hello. Given that you have adjusted to the thrown the first pitch for the White Chicago White Sox today, and that was very creative and acrobatic of you. And even after all that perfect balls and you're still not impressed. Oh, I see, because, because of your injury, you couldn't complete this year. But well, hey, let's have fun for a change. Go ahead and add you in. Yep, that's Mario, because M is your holding official. Alright, you're sitting at Grimmie. Zelda X left 64. What you got? Oh, I see. Donkey Kong. Alright. Well then, our, well then, we're also going to add on... Yeah. Luigi! Alright, I guess that's just a lucky letter of the day. Alright, so... Why don't we first start off with Yoshi's Tropical Island? Because Yoshi is so happy. So, yeah, we'll go about 20 turns. Yeah, no, we are not doing 35 or 50 because that's going to take way forever. Yoshi! So happy. I'm, I'm, I'm so happy that Yoshi's happy because it makes me happy when he is happy. Hello, everybody. I am Koopa Tukba, your guide, or the Yoshi's Live, Watermelon, and Cancel Up Islands. Yoshi on the middle island, while the Yoshi's best friend is worried and watches from the shore. Please do something. I know that these whirlpools are obstructing everybody. Now beware that Booba plays tricks on the happening spaces. That's what I see. Alright, Michaela, you are going first. Yeah. Uh, very special day for you today, huh? Yeah. Yep, I'm going second. Flatface is only third. Uh, unfortunately, Christina and Grimmy were going last. Zelda is left 64. Now, they're not actually here right now. Obviously. But, um, I don't know. They, well, I don't know. Maybe they can, like, sub subconsciously, you know, but if they're suffering right now, they can just, like, make it to their spirits and just come out over here just to play for the day or something. I don't know, but. Is it possible? Or whatever. Well, whether it is or not, it's just. I don't know, maybe it's just because, you know, this is Mario Party, so we might as well play. Yeah, that's what I thought. This is because Mario Party is a really, really cool game, you know? It's, it's, I mean, like, I, mean, I really like Mario Party 1, especially because it's the first Mario Party game to come out, and it's also the only Mario Party game that I have. And we, are, we already got a happening space going on already. We haven't got past the, that uh, thwomp yet, so I guess we're good for now, though. By the way, I don't even actually I don't even know if they even know each other at all. I don't know. I just simply chose them simply because they're at least they're they're both from the east and west coast. Well, actually, maybe that's what, what makes them not know each other. Actually, I think. Anyway, I don't really know what 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 uh, what factors that overall that would play anyway in a situation in any human because you know right now I am not on either coast so okay let's see where are we finish oh you Mario you only got TK oh okay and we take five coins only all right well. Was well, not very much change on the first. Ooh, 
Mario, you almost got Bowser right there. Alright, nine. Alright, well, since Bowser is on the other island, you know, why don't, why, why, what the hey, let's just, let's just stay on this one. I think this is the, uh, the Watermelon Island. Alright, Flatface, where are you going? Follow me and getting the Bowser already. Oh, Alright, well. Good thing Bowser Revolution was not on there, so alright, we're playing Facelift. It's basically, if you ever just play Facelift just as a mini game, well, that usually. Well, usually what happens is you just. Whoever has the most. Whoever gets 90 points or more just simply wins and then you get coins for it, but. This one, you're playing for survival, so that picture right there, you want to make sure you match it. It's really, really nice how they got the, uh, you know, they, they actually got the picture right there in the middle for you to look, everyone to look at. And then, they, and then nicely, they even tell you what, what character you, for by accordance to what character you are, you just, you can literally look after that. It's, it's pretty neat, I tell ya. Alright, slight Whoa, everybody won. Dang, that's the first time I've ever seen that happen. Everyone goes more, gets more than 90 points. Yeah, <laughs> flat face, totally. He, like, he, just, he was the one who landed on this face, maybe that's the reason why Bowser just simply took all the coins. That's when everyone wins. Now, you know, early on, you know, like last year, you know, Donkey Kong, did you just... No, I just do that. Oh. Really? DK? Now you gotta screw everyone on this island now? Oh, man. I'm wiggling around. Yep, when you're when you're as long as you're not the crane itself, then all you gotta do is just wiggle around. Press A repeatedly and rapidly. I'm not sure how much it really really helps though, but yeah, you, grab, you grab somebody, you don't get all of their coins, you only get one third. Man. Luigi he trying to get ten coins out of the chest, just missed it. Wow. That's really, really nice to know, you know. Mario, oh, wait, no, he doesn't, oh, wait, no. He does not have the enough coins to get the star. All right, that's nice. Well, and then he goes to Boo. Oh, no. Yep, I thought so. He's going after me. Let's, let's say really, really fast. That was a lot of coins. Well, at least we don't have very much to lose when we go up to Bowser. Well, and I got a one. Alright, that's nice. I don't want to get lots of coins just to lose it all to Bowser. Okay, that's Bowser. Ways. It's really not necessarily as easy as as you think it could be, because because one, it's really really hard to you know really get what, what you're looking for, and even when you find it, like still the, the timing of it really really is that tough in this game, I tell ya. And look at that, I just shot it too early. Look at that. Like, I'm gonna like pretty much waste like this 40 plus seconds 
it's just to fail at this mini game. Like, just watch. I'm not gonna get anything, especially this time. nothing this time. Okay, I'm not the only one, though. ZK didn't get anything either. Wow. Wow, even Mario and Luigi only got one coin. Wow, that, wow, that must be that disappointing. Alright, then. Alright, Mario, now you're gonna go away from the star now? You're not gonna stay on it? Oh, alright, well. Time, but well, I, and I didn't. All right. Honestly, Treasure Divers, I would say it, it would be. A, it's kind of. It's very. At least very decent. If not, it actually might be pretty good though because this one, like, you you cannot really lose coins from losing the mini game. You you can only like. You either didn't get anything, or you do gain coins. So like, so as I mean, like, so you all you gotta do is grab a big treasure chest, go for a dig for those, and then, and then you just, and then you just ch take it up to the surface of the ocean. And, like all that coins that come out of that treasure chest and go into that boat, if it's from you, it's yours, basically. And so. Else is like literally the AI is all being like, they're all keep on getting attacked by all these like, I don't know, is it just the jellyfishes or the shark? The shark is probably like the craziest thing here. But I'm getting the last treasure chest and I merely took very minimal attacks, I think, from the from it. Alright, make it up there, make it up there. No, jellyfish, leave me alone. Man, that was way too close. And I, well, I got the most coins this time. I'm really impressed with that. Alright, let's see what's up with this. Oh, no. 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 Yep, Bowsy took all our coins. And now it's not going really well. Alright, Flatface, get get down to my level. involved in this. Don't. Okay, you can stop that now. Okay, well, this is why I told you not to do this, because Luigi doesn't have any star. Because he's flat face. Flat face. Alright. And now we're all going against Mario now. Oh, that's right, because you got the red space and everyone else all got blue spaces except, well, yeah. Yeah, I don't know, we all, the rest of us all got blue spaces. I tell you, it, it would really, really suck if you're the one who had to simply choose which, which uh, pipe it, you had to go down. Because, trust me, like, this is really, really hard to decipher which which pipe you know, goes to which. It's, even Even when the advice tells you to, like... You know, to actually lo look carefully at how the pattern is. It it's still really, really difficult, though, because... 
And because like it, it just goes up, it scrolls up too fast, and then it doesn't let you review it. You know, like once you're, well, like yeah, you know, once it's all out there, so. Once you're all the way up, this, once the, the camera goes up to the top, you know, you really cannot review the the base. I I tell you, it is actually pretty bad, actually, if you really really think about it. All right, well, we probably could have had the star had you know, had, maybe had Mario landed on the happening space earlier. Oh, by the way, yeah, you know, Ko your Koopa will always give you a bonus in this game every time you go right past him. And usually that's 10 points. When the ending of the game is, like, near, he would, he'll actually start giving you 20. I think in, like, the last, like, five turns of the game, I think that's when he starts doing that. You see the whirlpools? Yes, I do. And we're always passing by them, unfortunately. That's why, and that's why the blue Yoshi's like jumping up and down. You know, because he doesn't really know what to do, does he? Well, the star power will get rid of all those whirlpools. It actually really, really will. Alright, so now let's hammer drop. You want to really be careful. Yo, watch out. Go under the shadows of things. Just make sure it's not a hammer that you get hit by. And also, don't go off the cliff, too. Otherwise, you can go to the platform. Otherwise, you're going to... Otherwise, you are going to get, you know, plunged right over. And then... I don't even know if the coins that you get from this game will even... Will even... It will even stay, remain yours, because... Because you go off the cliff. The time was up and while well, I still got the coin bag. Let's see if it counts. It does, and I got I got the biggest gain out of it. Wow. And Mario, I'm ready to see you get a star. I was playing as you in Super Mario 64 not that long ago. So it's no surprise for me. Actually, Actually, if you haven't, if in case you haven't watched any of my Super Mario 64 videos yet, apparently in one episode, like, or one, or yeah, like one video of it, I, I actually just talked to a toad that was right next to the Hazy Mazy Cave course entrance, the world entrance, rather, it's, and then, like, and then the toad just, like, gave me a star, like, right after I got the uh, green cap. And I believe it was also the same video where I finished Dire Dire Docks. Because I know it, it, it was certainly before I started the Jolly Roger Bay. So... I don't really know how to say this, but... Maybe the... May, uh, anyway, slot machine. People will try to say this is easy, but this is not easy. Like, I have never seen any human player ever get this. Like, only certain AI have gotten this before. Let's see how Donkey Kong goes with it, though. Dude, the coins are over there, man. You see, the, like, the success uh, music sound is actually different in this game because it's... Because actually, it is a really, really challenging. It's... And I tell ya, I'm really, really glad that I would never be playing that as long as I don't really don't play it. It'd be a waste of time. Alright, so, alright, now we're on Musical Mushroom again. Let's see how I do this time, because apparently Flatface stepped on me last time. Let's make sure that we that we, that it does not happen again this time.
that here. Alright, what is the what to deal with Bowser this time, really? Donkey Kong? Bowser Revolution. Oh no, it looks like I'm gonna lose a couple of coins here. This, this is what happens in Bowser Revolution. Every one has the same number of coins. It benefited Donkey Kong, but I think it hardened me a little bit. Well, we're all going against him. And it's Bash and Cash. Probably we're gonna since we already did a well, round of bash and cash already. Why don't we? You know, I don't know. Maybe I'll just try playing it the selfish way, the greedy way, to make sure that they bash the coins out and I get the cash. Finish. I should probably do it next time. 